I love, love, love this quick shifter and auto blip. It's just so smooth. Oh, uh, you saw that? It stopped the wheelie. It stopped it. So even at wheelie control one, it stopped it. I don't know where the hell I am, but it's very sketch, but try to give that car ahead of me a little bit of room so I can take that turn proper. Good stuff, baby. Good stuff. Oh, man. This bike makes me happy. Like, it makes me feel like a kid. You know what I mean? This bike makes me feel like a kid. What's good? Mike's in the building. Welcome to another video. I'd like to know, what is your intention for your RVE or your Ducati Hyper Motard Mono? I'm curious because I think a lot of people are buying this bike as a, their main Ducati, you know? It's like... It's my brand new, shiny, nice toy kind of thing. And for me, my approach for this motorcycle has been very, very different, very unique um, state of mind that I'm digging for me, what I need it for. It's not for anything fancy, nothing shiny. It's really a play toy. I mean, all the bikes are a play toy, but what about you guys? Um, what's your intention for this? I'm really curious, what is your overall idea for this bike? Stuff, baby good stuff I totally forgot to change into my raining my riding shoes crazy town funny thing is I don't think it's raining here let's check yeah, no rain in this section, okay. <laughs> Back with it, boys. Back with it. No rain out over here. So we're gonna troop around and keep it clapping, keep it clubbing. <laughs> oh man, this bike makes me happy. Like, it makes me feel like a kid. You know what I mean? This bike makes me feel like a kid. You know what it is? The bike is basically the KLX 140 RL in big boy format. That's what the, exactly what the bike is. And, uh, and it works. It's like perfect, you know? Nah, this person's scared. He's scared. And he's not boogieing it, man. Come on, boy. Got nice little pull, too, boy. Nice little... Oh, don't do it, boys. Don't do it. Let's see if we can find some nice little spot here we can rip a little bit. Quite a few cars behind me. If I can get ahead... I'll have that whole section open up so I can kind of rip a little bit. Ah, oh, there's too many cars going up ahead, man. It's all good. I'm going to pass this person too. Look with that. Why are you trying to wheels? I didn't ride that area without people being in front of me. I 
not give that car ahead of me a little bit of room so I can take that turn proper. Stop coming out. Oh, he didn't stop, so it's good. Is this still raining? I don't even know anymore. It's just like light drizzles, and I'll take it. Light drizzle, but I'll start making my way back. saw that it stopped the wheelie it stopped it so even at wheelie control one it stopped it it still stopped it let's try it again you'll see I must say guys I know you see me cutting up real hard with this bike early early on I am extremely like uh, comfortable with this bike from the jump with this bike so it's like you know I feel at home not even thinking as I'm doing anything it's just like very natural I don't know where the hell I am, but it's very sketch, but we'll see how it goes. Let's see where it takes us though. I'm curious. It definitely soaks up bumps really nicely though. I love sitting far back on it, just kind of coasting, rode through the rain a little bit and then pass on all the way down here. And as I was heading back home, it became dry again. So I'm like, let me just keep at it. Let's see where it takes me. Let's see where the road takes me. So Not a very pretty area, but it's all good. I'm not stopping, I'm just cruising through, so. I love, love, love this queer shifter and auto blip. It's just so smooth, zero disruption. Nobody's behind me. I definitely think it's gonna wheelie better when I'm on high power mode, not just uh, low power mode. Oh, every now and then I kind of shift and it goes straight to neutral. Not happening as much, but 